Hi, so today I'll do a work around on one of the most common git error that you might have faced or may face. So let's begin. So I got this error when I was trying to pull changes from remote repository to the local. I got this you have divergent branches and need to specify how to reconcile them. So today I will gonna demonstrate the same by replicating everything that I did then how I solved it and what was the root cause and what are the practices that we must follow so that we don't face such errors. Okay, So let's begin. So I am using Ubuntu EC2 instance as my local machine and I am using github as my remote. Okay. So to work with this suppose uh, we have one git error uh, repository in local cd git error ok if i do git status here it's not a git repository so to make any repository git we have to initialize it using git init so i am initializing this it got initialized now if i but we haven't set it's remote if i do git remote hyphen v it won't show me anything so now it's git it is tracked by git now we have to set a remote repository for this local so uh, go to the git hub from here create a new repository let's give it the same name you can give any i am giving it the same name okay it's available and i'm adding a readme file okay so our repository got created and you can see the initial commit has happened okay now let's get back to here now add that repository as origin here using command git remote add origin then copy this ssh url from github okay now if you do git remote hyphen v you can see our uh, local repository is attached is connected to our remote repository okay so suppose you have started working on this local for the example, I am just creating three empty files using touch command, touch A, B, C. If you do ls, you can see we have our three files. If I do git status, I can see I have all these files, but these are untracked. So let's track them using git. So let's do git add A, B, C. If I do git status, you can see they have they are ready to commit so after git add we have to commit with one message like added a b and c now let's push it to our main branch okay in remote when i am trying to push it to my remote repository it is getting failed even though I have already uh, set up my remote and you can see it has been set up is it pushing so I realized like what is the best practice we should do while working in local we should first pull our changes pull any changes from the remote because the access of remote can be with any developer so we should ensure that our local repository is in sync with remote repository as we can see uh, in our git hub we have one commit and we have this readme file is it here if i do ls no it's not here so what was the best practice the best practice was before pushing our changes before starting to work with local we should first pull our changes by doing git pull origin main and then we should push but even after pulling i am getting this error you have divergent branches i need to specify how to reconcile them so why it happened like 
if I have pulled it, then why this divergent branch is error I am getting? So, the reason is like the you are the this message is appearing because your local branch and the remote branch have been diverged, meaning they have separate commits that are not shared between them. If you do if you check the log by doing git log hyphen hyphen one line, you can see it has only this commit, but the initial commit was this that is not there in local that means our commits have been diverged so git is prompting this warning to specify how you wo how you want to reconcile this divergent branches by specifying a pull strategies so there are three options that you can choose from depending on your situation the default strategy is through merge but we have already done this like it will merge the remote changes into our local branch we have done this git pull origin main but it didn't work so let's move to the second uh, strategy the second one is rebase rebase will this will reapply your local commits on top of the remote branches commit and this can create a cleaner history but may require resolving conflicts you can use the following command to pull using the rebase strategy mm, this might work for our scenario because we want to reapply our look matlab it will reapply our local commits on top of the remote so yeah this will work now let's see the third one third one is fast forward this will only perform a pull if it can be done using a fast forward merge which implies that your local branch is behind the remote branch and has no additional commits but that's not true in our case like in we have already made some commits we have we made one commit now after adding uh, those three empty files so this won't work in our case so in our case this command will perfectly work so let's give it a try you can see successfully rebased and updated it now you can see when i do when i check the logs you can see our log that was there in remote it's now here in our local as well that means it's in sync now if i do git uh, git push origin main it will work uh wait wait git branch okay so currently we are in master branch so we need to do git push origin master yeah see our changes have been successfully merged now create a pull request for master on github so now let's go to here you can uh, see this message master had recent pushes so we need to compare and create a pull request added abc create pull request check it's checking this branch has no conflicts we need not to resolve the conflicts now we can directly merge conflict merged let's try to comment as merge then comment it confirm merge pull request successfully merge and close if i come to the code you can see our files have been successfully all the three files that we have created in our local have been successfully pushed to our remote repository so that is how we have resolved the error divergent error so mo many of the times we might face many errors and it mostly happens when we don't follow the best practices so the one of the best practice that i'll suggest is before working on your local make sure that every time you start first pull the changes from the remote repository 
do that first and then only uh, do your work because it might lead to some other errors like much conflicts and it might be frustrating at a time so it was all about this resolving that error i hope you get idea on this okay that's it i hope you enjoyed it thank you bye